just a couple of ways that the Catholic Church is not Christian. In fact, they are satanic. That bent cross being one, that is a representation of a dead, weak Christ on the cross. We know Christ isn't on the cross anymore. He's not in a tomb. The tomb is empty. He is risen, but yet they prayed him around as a dead Christ. All by claiming to be vicar of Christ instead of Christ. How satanic can you get? Also, it says, the Bible says in Matthew 23, 9, call no man father. For there is only one father. The father in that case, in that sense, means an authoritative position over the church. There's only one authority over the church, and that is Christ. It also says, call no, have no other masters, call no man a master, which the Freemasons love to do, which we, we can get into that later. This church, the Catholic church, means universal. It means you can be a Catholic Buddhist, a Catholic named religion. They have on many occasions called all world leaders of religion and, like the presidents, to the Vatican in order to call for one world religion. Where have you heard that before? In, the, in Revelations, there's one world religion, one world government, and one leader over all that, the Antichrist. This is, I believe, the church in which Antichrist is going to come out of. The Vatican has so much power. I believe they're probably more powerful than a lot of these other world economic forms and all that. I believe that they're really behind everything and staying back in the shadows. That's my opinion. But... Why does the president or all these world leaders go to see the Pope? And just notice sometimes it's actually before they actually become leaders or presidents. It's almost as if they're getting the blessing from this man here. So either way, whether you believe that or not, everything this church does or represents is pagan, a.k.a. satanic, and goes against all teachings of the Bible. They have tried to take Christ's authority on this earth.